it's the jokester here back for another video and we've got two big old packages to un unbox from first four figures it's been a while since I got my second package from them because they just really didn't have anything I wanted till now so yeah we're going to unbox these two bad boys and check them out so here we go like always, it's a box inside a box, because they have to make it really secure so it don't break. So, yeah, time to get the box out of a box. Boxception. And here we go, what do we have? Dark Souls, Dark Souls. That's embossed, feels really nice. Dark Souls, isn't that too hard? Uh, it is for casuals. Anyways, let's check out and see what we got. Look at that. 9 inch PVC exclusive edition. It looks so pretty. That's embossed. Oh, this package looks so great. And it's Solera of Astoria in miniature form. So yeah, let's open this up and check it out. We have our little day one cards and a little sticker down here, which is pretty, pretty cool. And then you just, uh, whoops. You just lift up this little tab right here and you actually get to the figure. So yeah, this was like a box inside a box inside a box inside a box. So yeah, let me get this one out and check it out. And here we actually have the figure. There's the box. There's the side. There's the back of the box. Which looks really, really cool. There's the other side. Now let's get this guy out. I also want to show this little leaf. It has a little advertisement and also has bonus points for uh, their online store. So you can use that, which is pretty cool. And anyways, as you can see, this actually, they improved it from my Artorius one over there. That one used like watch type batteries. This is USB powered now. So it's got a light up effect and you don't have to worry about it running on batteries. Or replacing a battery. They definitely improved it. So yeah, let's get him out and check him out. Here's the little USB device, which is really nice. I'm really glad they did that upgrade. And then let's check out the actual statue here. Look at that. He's got his little logo right there. It looks really nice, well painted. Look at the chain mail on him. That looks great in his little hand and his helmet. He looks so cute. He is just praise the sun worthy. Now, you have to be careful with these because these could, can snap off. Those are way too thin, if you ask me. I kind of wish they weren't as thin. I hope they don't break off. you got to be really careful so they don't break off. But yeah, that is Artorius, and I am happy with him. We'll definitely have to char try out the USB-powered stuff um, as soon as we can and check it out. Um, I believe there's a switch down there at the bottom. Let's see if it actually will turn on without any powered cord. And as you can see, it glows. Now, I have the USB plugged into my PlayStation. And yeah, you got you got two different modes. You got this mode and then hold on. You have a more dimmer mode, which looks cool. Now, if I can turn off the lights. Oh yeah, this one pulses. So it'll go on and off and kind of fade out kind of like he's being summoned for the first time, which is really really neat. You see how that works? That is just beautiful. This is fantastic. You are outdid yourself, uh, FRF. Um, some things going on, you know, but overall, you know, the quality of the products is still pretty good. And I really like this. It's just you got to be careful with these because these can easily break off. And you don't want that happening at all. Yeah, that's really, really cool. Now, let's move on to the next statue. Now, if you take a look at this, you think, oh, crap, you bought the same thing twice? This one's actually a little different. This is the Praise the Sun edition, and the box has got a different color. When we open this up, you'll see the difference, which is pretty cool, so give me a sec to do that. Okay, so this is a little different. They put the cards on the bottom for some reason, and it didn't have any white uh, uh, kind of white paper to tear off of it like a present around this one so that's a little odd maybe it was just 
uh, and mess it up probably in the factory they forgot to add that around it but it's not a, not a big deal so we'll check that out real quick and we're back as you can tell there is a huge difference between these two um this one is the praise the sun edition where he's pretty much the glowy summon sign color uh, and then this is what he normally looks like when you encounter him in the game without having him summoned. But when he becomes a summon, he takes on a glowy, you know, sun thing. And in this one, he's supposed to light up through his whole body. So we're going to plug that in and check that out. And check that out. He's glowing through his whole body. Let me turn off the lights so y'all can better see it. Oh, no. There you go. Praise the sun edition. He looks great. I got it set on the one where he fades in and out and he kind of glows. It's it's really cool. It's just, it's really neat. <laughs> you can literally use these guys as night lights. But yeah. Thanks FRF for these amazing statues. They're both wonderful. I really like both of them. I... <laughs> I'm so glad they had payment plans that made this easier. I was literally paying like 50 bucks a month or so till I got them paid off. But they're both worth it. It's just now I need to figure out where I'm going to place them. And uh, <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do. But yeah, this is an awesome unboxing. And until next time, this is the Jokester signing out. See ya and praise the sun.